Hi everyone, John Paul here from InMotion Hosting and thank you for joining us for another video in our WordPress in Motion series. Today I'm going to show you how to put your WordPress site in debugging mode. Alright, I first recommend bringing up the WordPress guide on turning on WordPress debugging. And you see I have it up here and we're going to scroll down and we're going to copy these two lines here. So you can control C after you select them like I've done or you can right click and copy. Once you've copied those, we're going to log into cPanel. So go ahead and log in. Okay, once you've logged in, we're going to go and click the file manager icon here under files. That's going to let us view and access the file. And if you get a directory selection come up like this, just go ahead and click go. If you know what folder you want to go to, you can go ahead and select it. And in my case, I'm looking for the wp-config.php file, which is there. And you see mine is in the public underscore HTML folder. Yours may be in a different folder. You're going to want to open that folder first, and then, and then you'll find your wp-config.php file. Once you've clicked it, click the code editor here. And if you get, you're going to get some information here about the code editor. Just go ahead and click edit. Okay. And you see, I can see the actual contents of my wp-config.php file. What I'm going to do is scroll down to the bottom, and I'm going to paste that code in here. And it's just those two lines. And basically, if you look at it, it's saying to the wp, uh, WP debug true and script debug true. And that is basically turning those two options on in your WordPress site. And you may see that you see this here, a debugging line already existing there. In my case, I'm just going to go ahead and delete that since we just added the line. You can also just change that to true instead of false. Okay, once you've added the two lines, we're going to click the save button here on the top right. You'll see a success message come up. And that's it. You've enabled debugging on your WordPress site. Now if your WordPress site gets an error, it will display on the page. Thank you for joining us for another video in our WordPress in Motion series. Feel free to like this video and comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? It's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.